What is up guys, Zach Scott here playing Bloons Adventure Time TD and we still got some more of the Halloween event. So we're gonna go ahead and finish that up today. Uh, have some fun, unlock Clarence. Let's go ahead and play the Badlands Desert of Wonder right now. A three skull level. I'm happy with how things are. I don't feel the need to actually do the impoppable tongue twister right there because uh, it just takes a lot longer, but I, I'll go ahead and do extreme. That doesn't seem so much of a big deal. Uh, so we'll do extreme. We'll go in here. We'll have some fun. And uh, I don't know if my strategy is going to change too much, but things are looking pretty good for me right now. Uh, this one's going to go down here, and we get the benefit of it coming around here too. So I, I wouldn't mind putting, uh, you know, uh, Jake, or I'm sorry, Finn right here, and uh, increasing his range a little bit. He'll get two shots at it. And uh, if I put him down further, uh, that might work. And then I'll go ahead and make sure that uh, Tuxedo Jake is in the vicinity as well. Um, of course, uh, keep in mind, you know, I've been doing an accelerated strategy where I go and consume these coins, get out two BMOs. And in general, this has been working pretty darn good for me. Um, go ahead and give him a limber limb so he can reach just a little bit farther. And then the BMOs, uh, you know, it's gonna, they'll, it'll happen, it'll happen, don't worry. We'll, we'll fast forward. We'll get the BMOs making some uh, fantastic currency for us. And uh, we're going to get Clarence. I, I know we will. So let's do this Halloween event. I did an impoppable uh, last episode in case you guys wanted to see that. Uh, it worked out pretty well. Go ahead and uh, upgrade BMO there. BMO, BMO, BMO. There you go. And then uh, 500 to upgrade them uh, next. Of course, this initial bout is not going to be a big deal. Uh, we don't really start facing, to me, it seems we, we don't start facing any real challenge until, um, oh, what would I say? I, I guess I would say we don't start facing any real challenge until round 40, maybe? I don't know. At least with this setup, we don't. I might even do uh, something easier for the next couple rounds, and then for the last round, come back to the 60 rounds. Uh, we'll see about it, though. We'll, we'll see. Things are going pretty darn good for us. I don't have many complaints. I kind of wish there was like a super fast forward mode, but that's okay. Uh, we could upgrade last but not least. There we go. So we got two BMOs out. I'm pretty happy with it. I don't know if I would need any more than two ever. Especially with the ability to just generate the money on the fly. So let's keep going here. What do we want to do? Tuxedo Jake, I think, is going to be the next target. I think that's my typical build setup, and it works pretty well. And we are ready to put him out here. Tuxedo Jake, don't you want to be here? This will also give him the Bro Fist ability. Uh, we got to do right in the gloves first. Right, Bro Fist is going to be 1100 again. There we go. And I could use another coin, but I don't think we're going to need to, especially just for the 60 rounds. La 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 la. Bro fist coming up as soon as I uh, drain some money from the BMOs. There we go. Bro fist right here, right now. Okay, yes. Look at this. Look at this. Boom, 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 boom. We're going to be generating a lot. And, and of course, for him, oh, one got through. One got through. You see that? We're going to do turn it up. Uh, Allegro Tempo will be at 1,200. Boom. Bro fist. Oh, some of these ghost balloons got through. Oh, a couple did, actually. That's okay. We're fine now. We're fine. Uh, Allegro Tempo. Uh, we're going to do Inspiring Melody soon as well. But I think I might need to bring out uh, a Marceline. Hunter Marceline could be really useful. Or I could just kind of, uh, I could upgrade um, Finn a little bit more. I don't think, uh, either way, I think it's going to work for us. Uh, let's see what we want to do. Inspiring Melody at 35. Let, let's go ahead and put out Hunter Marceline. She's definitely one of my favorites, of course. Wonder what Bloon's souls taste like. <laughs> yeah, I, I wonder what Bloon's souls taste like too. Let's get these from BMO. Now we want. Um, 
We want an inspiring melody because inspiring melody uh, nearby characters can pop any balloon type and that'll be at 3500 and then when that actually kicks in uh, we're not gonna see the right now see these uh, these camo balloons are actually taking uh, are, are, are getting destroyed anyway so that's good is it the soap it might be the soap I can't tell um cha ching come on 3500 give us 3500 we'll have it very soon so close. We probably could have had it if I would have uh, taken uh, the, the funds out of uh, BMO here. Oh, there we go. Now, uh, Inspiring Melody, full orchestra, catchy tunes is just, uh, yeah, I don't know. Uh, I don't know about catchy tunes. We probably don't need to do anything else on that front. We can probably focus just on Hunter Marceline for now. Because she seems to be doing, like I said, all the heavy lifting. Uh, Blood Rush. Hunter training, garlic bomb, uh, circular p flight path, stronger garlic, advanced hunter training coming up as well. There we go. And then uh, soul sucking, smart stakes, those are both crucial upgrades as well. But overall, and I'm not even doing the busker, uh, I don't think it's necessary for a stage like this where they circle back twice. Or, you, or at least uh, uh, Finn will get to encounter them twice. Soul sucking, there you go. Mass soul sucking, might as well. We could also upgrade uh, Finn a little bit. Flying kick at 8.50. I think with just this trio, not much is going to get past me, but we'll see. I might do the other Marceline as well. Mad skills. Mad skills. Twenty-nine 29.75 for smart stakes. We may not even have any difficulty around 40 at all. This might just be going perfect by then, you know? All right, smart stakes and no more upgrades for her for now. Uh, Finn, let's see, Finn, no, I, I don't, I never usually get the Finn of Fury. Um, so another thing that we could, I mean, we might be just fine with this. But I'll probably go ahead and do the other Hunter Marceline. Improved flight, oh, telekinesis, okay. base expert. So now the path, I'm gonna follow the balloons so that she actually tracks down the balloons and she's right up in their faces. And then I'll give her the eating red as well. There we go, eating red. And you know, necromancy's fine, shape shifting's fine. But again, not really required. I'll go and give her ne necromancy and improve necromancy. It's pretty cool. It's an ability. Check it out. You do this, and skeletons are everywhere. And you know they do a, they do an okay amount of damage. I just don't think we're gonna have any real issue with this. I think these balloons are gonna be okay. I say that, but then I also like to put out the ice, uh, the ice king here. Um, where do, we... yeah, there. This is actually a good spot for him. I don't mind just spending all my money on the ice king really quick, because he has some ranged attacks that work really well. Like I don't, I don't want to just sit here and do nothing, you know. Haha, uh -huh, there we go. We're doing pretty good still. Round 40 is about coming up. Oh, 
We're gonna give him freeze lightning super quick. I mean, yeah, we're controlling these blooms pretty well. We'll see what happens when the Moabs get here, but I think Finn's gonna be able to take care of the Moabs just fine. I'm gonna go ahead and give her improved necromancy. Oh, here's her first Moab. Let's see how, yeah, there we go, easy. I am curious if we'll get through. I mean, I don't know. I don't want to risk it. I would hate to lose this, but I'm curious if this is enough to take care of everything. I think it is. We'll find out soon. If things get dicey, I'll, uh, I'll add some more characters. I'm just trying to kind of save up a bunch of uh, coins right now. Of over 4,000. That's not so bad. So we got two Moabs now. Let's see how we handle two. Just fine. Well, we got two more. Well, we got three more, actually. Let's see how we handle three at a time. Uh, just fine. So yeah, no real qualms about this. This is going extremely well. Let's see. Uh, there we go. 47 coming up now. Yeah, so I'm looking at these balloons. I'm not seeing anything uh, that's, that's worrying me yet. When some of the bigger Moabs come out, we'll see how we handle them, but I think we're gonna be just fine. I'm trying to figure out like the minimal strategy for something like this, you know? And these are good practice practices to do. For Impoppable, I would be going all out. But like I said, we beat an Impoppable last episode, so. I'm not too worried about it. We're just decimating a ton of balloons. All right, let's see what happens. All right, got him. Here comes round 51. We could start putting out the skeletons. Maybe those will be fun. Maybe those will be a little helpful. I don't know. Yeah, I might do shorter, uh, shorter matches for the next few, just because I want to unlock Clarence. And then when I do have clearance, uh, I want to have time to show them. So maybe we'll do a couple short ones here. Here's a red Moab. Let's see what happens with these reds here. Can we handle the red? Let's see. I hope we. I, I'm pretty sure we can, but let's just see how this plays out. Is he going to get all the way to Finn before uh, breaking up? He broke before Finn, but he gets over there, and yeah, perfect. Everything is, works out. We're probably going to have an extra 20,000 plus. Maybe even 25,000 by the end of this. Alright, they got right there on us.
Round 57 is going to have a lot more Moabs, but... Again, I think we're handling them just fine. I'm not worried one bit yet. And this might be like the minimum layout that I go for from now on, if this is true. All right, here comes a red. Come on, Marceline, get up there. We're actually gonna have two reds, so we'll see how we handle two reds this time around. Oh yeah, we might have over 30,000 by the end of this. I think we're gonna be just fine with two reds. What's 59 about? Is 59 just a bunch of balloons with no Moabs? Perfect. All right, let's do this. This is the big one. Here it comes. Let's see. If, I hope that we can handle him without doing anything extra. I think we'll be able to, but I want to see it. If it gets too dicey, I'm going to start throwing out a bunch of stuff, but I, I don't know how that's going to work. I could always just throw out the elephant and just be done. Oh yeah, there we go. Now they all broke up into reds. Now they're blues. And, ooh, geez, this is actually a little bit scary, but the Marcelines are taking care of it. Nice, level complete, awesome. Okay, well, can't complain too much about that. Now show, me the loot. show me the loot. We got uh, ZZ things, three of them. Who who takes ZZ things? We got some reds as well. Wish orbs, XP. All right, let's open up one of these wish orbs here. Ooh, a purple. What's it gonna be? I already have it, darn, I have all of these, so I could just, uh, I could go ahead and just scrap this. Let's just go ahead and uh, shard and get 300. That's 300 shards for me, baby. Discard. All right, now let's go home and uh, take a look at what we got. So we got more ZZ things, which is also, I guess, 12 extra ZZ things, right? And then, uh, who uses ZZ things? Let's figure this out, let's go to our characters. Because uh, I, don't, I don't remember who uses them. Let's just look at Finn really quick. Uh, he has more allies to choose from, more trinkets. He uses Finn cakes. Who uses ZZ things? Who the heck uses, what are ZZ things? I may not even know. Uh, I don't know what ZZ things are. <laughs> just realized I don't know what they are. Uh, what? Okay, hold up, three quests, what is this? Nah, we're not doing those. Okay, anyway, um, ZZ things. What are ZZ things? I didn't mean to click that. Uh, back. Next map. Yeah, I'm gonna have to speed this up to do the next map because, uh, but what are ZZ things? Info. Collect enough to unlock special, you learn ZZ things. All challenge maps feature a new enemy, ghost balloons. Oh, wait, wait a second, wait a second, wait a second. Is it saying that I need, oh, I get it. Oh my gosh, I get it. I need ZZ things to, oh my gosh, I just realized that. I need ZZ things to unlock, um, to unlock, I need 35 ZZ things to unlock Clarence. I have 13 ZZ things, so, oh my gosh. I might have to do a bit of a grind here. I just realized that, holy cow. I don't know how much of the grind you would wanna see on, on video. That's why, that's why I need to do, okay. That's why I need to do it. 35, we're not even halfway there. Oh geez. <laughs> um, okay, well, I mean, yeah, three at a time. Um, yeah, this could be a bit of a, uh, a little while here. Let's go ahead and speed, speed, speed it up and do the map again. 
Um, sure. Finish now for 49 gems. Let's do. Uh, we've done we've done these before. I don't know. Maybe I should do a lot of this on my own off camera, then come back once we have clearance, so I have enough time to. Because it's gonna take me like maybe an hour to do this. Uh, so maybe I'll do that, and then when we come back, I'll uh, I'll have all the ZZ things, and we can showcase clearance. All right, guys. I know I've skipped ahead, uh, but I'm gonna go ahead and finish this up, and then we'll have enough of the materials to unlock clearance. Uh, we are almost done here, in fact. This is round 58. I played a lot on my own, like several, several rounds, but finally, we're, we're ready to have 35. So let's see what we can do here. We're just waiting on these to come through. Even though uh, Marceline is up front, she's only done like 5,000 something damage. Uh, this isn't, that damage isn't real. Uh, this is 46,000 damage, though, for Hunter Marceline, so. Hunter Marceline is obviously the superior performer here. And Finn has done 8,000. The elephant here's only done 2,000. So most of this is all Hunter Marceline. Most of it. The others have good effects and whatnot, but this is, you know how it goes. There we go, let's go again. One more round uh, after this. And we'll be good. And I'm probably just going to use the elephant's ability to, to cancel out that big thing at the end. Here we go. We got it. As soon as it shows up close enough, elephant is going to do his thing. Here we oh, go. Boom. Gone. Level complete. All right. So let's see what Clarence is all about. Ta-da, ZZ Things, three. I should have 35 now. Let's uh, let's see for sure. And sure, put all of those away. Now let's see, we're gonna recruit Clarence. Now let's go ahead and open this Wish Orb though. I don't need to reroll. I'll take uh, this and since I already have it, I'll shard it. And then discard the rest. Shard and discard. Uh, so here we go, we now have 35 ZZ things. And look at that, Clarence is now here. Very cool. Uh, detects camo, can remove zombie graves. Cons is specialized, so sure. I can see that. I wanna take a screenshot of this guy though. We are done with the uh, Halloween event. Uh, Halloween, congratulations, you have won all the prizes from this event. Challenge maps will now award shards instead of ZZ things. So keep playing to earn them all. Super cool. Well, we could uh, go ahead and look at our characters really quick. Let's see what we need to do here. Um, I think, is, can Finn be upgraded yet? He has 72 of 75 Finn cakes. He's almost there uh, to be upgraded to level seven. I think I'll get a new ability at level seven, I think. Uh, let's just use some cosmic essences and go ahead and level him up. Level seven, does he have a new ability? Finn's level is up. He has a big hearted hero and he has another trinket slot. Uh, we'll see what the big hearted hero is. I don't know about any trinkets right now, other than, uh, let's see, what, what can he have? Can he? Is there anything that looks really, really good for Finn? Finn, I mean, man, I don't know. Most of the damage is done by uh, uh, Hunter Marceline, but for regular Marceline, I'm gonna go ahead and, and put on a um, another ally here. I'm gonna bring in Clarence. So go ahead and equip Clarence. And then we should be able to see what happens when we bring it, bring him in, bring her in, Clarence in. And uh, let's see, let's go ahead and uh, let's go ahead and try. Let's just jump into another one of these because it's going to be. Uh, we'll get some shards for it. Sure, whatever. I've been spending a ton of gems just going through this. That's fine. Let's go in. Uh, let's do a. Uh, should we do? What should we do? Um, let's just do uh, an ex. Let's just do a. I don't know, let's just do a hard. Let's just do a hard. I don't wanna to take too much time and we're gonna be able to showcase this character pretty quickly. Uh, so, you know, for me, how much is that character to drop out? Clarence, where you at? Clarence is only 600. Um, I might just drop out Clarence immediately and see what happens. Although, I don't know if Clarence is gonna do anything. Let me drop out Finn immediately. Then we'll get Clarence the very next. So F Finn's coming out, excuse me, right there. And uh, we're gonna get some money there so I can put uh, 
Since we're only going 45 rounds, I don't know if I really need, even need to focus on BMO so much. No, let's go and do it. I don't want to be. I don't. I don't want to lose this. <laughs> so let's go ahead. Here we go. Let's just let's just get this done, and then we'll get BMO upgraded, and then we will. Um, we'll do what we can do to showcase this. This will be fun. Clarence, what you about? Halloween event over. Bemo, meow. All right, here we go. Cha Ching, come on, we're we're trying to get to 500. Got it. For now, he's doing great. I, I want to get Clarence out here quickly, though, just so we can see what he's all about. I'll put him up front, too, just to see if he does any, like, damage or destroys any balloons before uh, we even make it to Finn. Alright, as soon as we get the chance. Around 600-something. Clarence is coming out. So, Clarence... This is Tree, a Deceased Dagger Ascension and Mass Ascension. Very cool. Let's see. Hold on. Let's get him out. Here we go. I'm going to put him up here. Excuse me. So let's see what he does. What does Clarence do? Okay. He's attacking the balloons. Let's let's figure this out one more time. Um, Deceased Dagger increases damage to zombie and ghost balloons. Uh, destroys up to six zombie balloon graves in range each round. And it destroys all zombie graves in range each round. So okay, if there if this ever becomes an issue, the zombie graves, I don't know. I, I'll I haven't seen them lately, uh, but I haven't been. I guess I haven't been paying attention to what they drop. There you go. I really don't know what we're going going to expect with the graves, if anything at all. There's Clarence doing his best. Cha-ching! Um, who else? Which else should we do? Tuxedo Jake. Oh, I can't even put him there. There we go. Put him, put him right there. Turn it up. I'm gonna get Finn limber limbs. Uh, let's spend another coin to get right in the gloves, and we're so close to Bro Fist. Come on, Bro Fist, around the corner. Brofus. There we go. There goes Clarence doing his thing. And, uh, you know, if this this character does the most damage of all. So there we go. This, this from now on is going to be fine. It's going to be just her doing every bit of damage for sure. I don't see any of the graves. Like when they say specialized, I mean I, I really do believe that it's specialized. The rest of this, though, we're gonna go through just fine. Cha ching. Soul sucking. Mass soul sucking. Smart stakes are next, but I'm gonna focus on Allegro Tempo for Tuxedo Jaco. And this should be, uh, we should fly through this. There's only 45 rounds. So I'm just gonna be sure to keep launching the rounds over and over. Inspiring Melody will be next. Oh yeah, we, we just got that new fin upgrade. We can check that out too. I kinda wanna see, but let's see what the, what the heart thing's about. Uh, the new big hearted hero is after Moab Ripper prevents prevents game loss and restores all lives once. So that's really cool. Um, but again, I haven't really had that issue lately, so I'll go ahead and try to get it on him if we have enough coins. But uh, I don't think it's going to matter. We're we're not going to be faced with that with that danger. I don't think. And I don't really want to put myself in that danger because I don't. Although it would be cool to showcase, I don't want to lose the round. Big Hearted Hero, 850. All right, well, we're doing good. I'll go ahead and give him Ascension just because. Go 
And then Mass Ascension, of course. Why not? Just for funsies. Got you, Clarence. We only gotta go 45 rounds. I don't think we're in any real danger of losing, especially with uh, Hunter Marceline. Like, truly the all-star of, of all of my builds here. I really need to do uh, Inspiring Melody so that Hunter Marceline can take out even more. See, so far, you know, he's only done 721 damage. Hunter Marceline, 2,000. Finn, only 400. So it's all pretty much, you know, it's all pretty much Hunter Marceline. Absolutely. We need uh, 3,500, though, in order to get the uh, Inspiring Melody. We're almost there. There we go. Now, Hunter Marceline won't have any problems taking care of any of the balloons. And again, she's really just doing all, every bit of heavy lifting. Pretty much every bit of light lifting, too. She's just doing all the lifting. She works out. Very cool. Look at that. She's just shredding them. She's melting them. I just want to do hard because, like, uh, I just wanted to showcase Clarence. And I didn't want to go 60 rounds. It's a 15 extra rounds just to showcase Clarence. But we already showcased him, except that we don't have any graves. So, yeah, no. Round 45 is not going to be difficult to beat at all. And you saw me last episode do Impoppable, so. We good. Five more rounds. Couple more rounds left. It's round 44. And I have tons of excess. Like, I really. She, take care, she takes care of everything. This might be a little bit. No. Never mind. I thought it was going to be a little bit of a challenge, but nope. Alright, there we go. Level complete. And so we get shards now. Is that what we get instead of. Uh... Let's open it up. What do we get? We got uh, coins. One fin cake, 50 shards, not, not very many shards at all. But again, we were just here to have some fun completing the Halloween event. Thank you for watching, guys. Let's go ahead and open up this green wish orb, although it's probably not gonna have anything I need. But here we go, let's go ahead and open it up. Uh, I'll take this, the nail gun, no special properties, but pierce plus three. That's for her, keep it, but she probably already has something better. But hey, discard the rest. Uh, almost level 30, maybe hit that next episode. We're good. We're great, in fact. Halloween event, a success. See you next time for more. Goodbye. Wait, wait. We got some achievements. Collect this. Excellent. Collect that. Collect, collect. I don't know if I want three, so many wish orbs. Okay, we're good. It's gonna make me open a bunch of wish orbs. It's gonna make me open a bunch of white wish orbs. Uh, just give this and shard it, right? I haven't done anything with my shards yet. Alright, get this and shard it too. I wasn't expecting to get so many of these wish orbs. It doesn't matter, just get one of these things and shard it for like, what, 10 shards? Yeah. <laughs> Okay, discard. We're done, hopefully. Oh, green. Okay, I'll take the green. I mean, it doesn't matter. Still got them all. So, discard. Shard. There you go. And... Okay, we're, we're done. I don't know what to do with all the shards. Uh, I can make an epic, actually. Let's make an epic. What else am I going to do with the shards? Craft. There we go. We done? Here we go. This is fun, right? Uh, let's see what we got. Hopefully we don't have these. 
Oh, nice. They're all new. Um, okay, 4D sword, RC plane, uh, ball blam, uh, burglar, burglar. <laughs> uh, who's this for? It's for her. Increases blast radius by 20%, plus 1% per star, and pops lead. That's pretty good. Who's this for? Uh, slows balloons, including Moabs, on contact with a 5% chance to destroy them completely. What? Who's this for? Nice. Um, who's this for, though? The plane. Oh, it's a trinket for anyone. A small plane flies around equipped characters shooting darts at balloons. That's pretty cool, too. Uh, I think I want this, this gun, though. Let's go ahead and take it. Keep that. And the rest I could just kind of get for gems, but I'm kind of out of gems for now. So discard them. That was fun. Uh, I might equip that on her, right? Let's see. Hopefully she doesn't already have a legendary. Uh, let's see what we got, though. PB, what, what do you got? Yeah, so we, we're replacing your gun with a much better one. There we go. Swap it out. There you go. Nicely done. Okay, well, guys, thanks for watching. Come back next time for more. We get to spend some shards. We get to have some fun this Halloween event. Still got a few more stages left. I'll see you next time for those. Goodbye. I'm Zach Scott. Subscribe if you have not. If you like this video and want to help this channel grow, all you got to do is click the like button below. Thank you so much for watching. Check out these other awesome videos. Follow me on Twitter and Instagram. Join my Discord. And if you want cool shirts like this, visit ZachScott.shop.